to today's vlog. Today is Sunday, it is just about to hit nine o'clock and we are off to go down to the foreshore again because we've already been there this morning. But we're going off and we're going to meet Jason after he goes for his run. So we went down to the foreshore and we were just waiting for Jason to arrive for his run. He got there, he had a shower, all that kind of stuff and we are like, what do we do now? And then Jason didn't have breakfast at home so I'm just like, let's go get you breakfast and me and Freddie can go like have like a piece of cake or something. So we ended up going to our favourite place. Just because we had to. Cause just because we, we yeah. could. So we did. So we just went to our favourite place. Now we are back into the car and we're heading to Bunnings to get a few things for Frederick's new bedroom. We finished up at Bunnings and yes we didn't vlog because we were like busy walking around the whole Bunnings. But it, we ended up getting the paint that we wanted for Frederick's bedroom. We really like it. It and is. For the Oh, and for the spare room, because we've got paint, white paint for the spare room. But um, Frederick ended up doing not one, but two accidents in Bunnings. Oh, thank you, babe. <laughs> so now it's time to head home. Yep. Head home and enjoy some peace and serenity. We're just joking, we're going to be cleaning when we... So we've been home for a couple of hours and literally we have just been cleaning i've been cleaning the windows and jason has been cleaning the bathroom and laundry he's also doing the dusting he is being a really good housewife right now better than probably i have ever been yeah i'm just about to make some lunch for myself and jason and then we're just chilling basically for the rest of the afternoon except for we do have to make one more errand for today so i think that's what we're going to be doing um in the afternoon So Jason's just gone out to go get Frederick's new bed that we bought him the other day. We're just getting it because we have to get it within seven days of ordering it. So we're getting it today because it's the last day we can get it before Jason goes back to work. So we're getting it today. It's just going to be stored in the spare room until we can actually do Frederick's room, which is the next time Jason is home. I thought while Jason is out doing that kind of stuff, I'm going to do some yoga because I really need to. yoga workout was a video from YouTube. Her name is Boho Beautiful. She does absolutely amazing yoga workouts. I absolutely love it. Today's one was all about shoulders and core and oh my god it worked like a treat. It was so good. Definitely subscribe to her because her workouts are perfection. Like they're so good and they actually make me sweat. But guys while we're outside and while I'm just you know, chilling a little bit outside, waiting for Jason to get home to see this new bed of Frederick's. I want to show you guys my veggie garden because it's going insane and I've got veggies in there that I need to actually harvest. So first things first, this is one of my kales. My other one is here, but unfortunately he got eaten by a caterpillar. But this one is getting attacked by snails. So I don't know if I can put something in my soil or something to deter the snails from eating my lovely kale. This is my spinach. He's coming back alive. I don't know if this one's going to come back alive. It looks like it's bringing up 
new leaves but all the old leaves are obviously dead like these are all old leaves so they're all dead he didn't survive very well through the transit of getting into my garden now on to my tomatoes well this bush looks kind of dead doesn't it but my tomatoes are actually still thriving really well I don't know why this dead this plant looks so dead but it does I feel like I need to probably take all of these leaves off but he's still alive He's growing his tomatoes really well, but I don't know what's going on. I have no idea. But then I got this tomato plant and he's going very well. This one's doing very well. This is the one that I need to harvest and obviously these need to be harvested quite soon. And this guy's also getting a little bit of a color on him and I've got some other little ones growing in there, which is exciting. These aren't fruiting until spring but he is growing really big let me just zoom out so you guys can see him but it is he is growing really big I need to get a stand so he can start climbing because he's just climbing out at the moment my blueberry tree is growing obviously all these are new foliage that makes me really happy that it's got new foliage on it ready to fruit for me for spring strawberries over here are actually growing they're like double the size since i got them also they're getting attacked by snails or caterpillars or both here's my corn my corn is looking fabulous as you can see it's actually producing corn this one is obviously not getting protected by its shell because he's not very big compared to the other ones but it is producing corn which is a good thing but yeah my veggie garden is doing so well i'm so happy with that next i'm going to purchase carrots and i've got some sweet potato that are pruning in my pantry which I need to um plant also they're like got their little like I don't know what they are but anyway they're going crazy in my pantry so I need to get them out and actually plant them <laughs> my veggie garden is going so well and I can't wait to actually taste my own veggies on my veggie garden my, my if I have told you guys or not I really can't recall me telling you but I also feel like I have but anyway this little I, munchkin I down here is in day six I, I, of being in undies it is insane I, I, I honestly can't remember if I said something or if I didn't you want me to brush your hair basically Frederick is day six of wearing undies it probably explains if I didn't say anything why he had accidents in Bunnings today but if I did, you would already understand why he had accidents in Bunnings today. But anyway, he's doing really well with toilet training and with having undies on at the moment. But he's doing really well for someone who isn't being pushed to toilet train. He's doing it on his own accord. And I'm actually super, super, super proud of him. I thought toilet training was meant to be really hard, but so far Frederick is doing so well that I don't think it's hard at all. I will probably regret those words sometime, but at the moment I am not regretting them. Just popped dinner into the oven. We're basically having what I had for lunch. So we're just having mixed vegetables. I've also popped in some chickpeas in there so we can get some more protein into our dinner. And I've also marinated some tofu so we can have that for dinner for like extra goodness for us. But I would just end the vlog now while I'm cooking tea because after this, you know the deal, it's just bedtime straight after tea. So we're not really doing much after this. I kind of felt like I got my mojo back because if you've seen my Instagram picture the other day, I would have you would have seen that I was talking about that I felt like I've lost my mojo a little bit and I've just been failing this week at trying to get some vlogs up for you guys and everything's just been going downhill and I was like today's the last day I'm trying because I just felt like my mojo was just leaving the building and finally I have it back but anyway I'm going to get going so I hope you all enjoyed this video and we'll see you guys next time bye